Standing squarely in the Bills' way are the surprising Boston Patriots. Buffalo has one loss to the Pats, and the visit to Beantown promises to be a long afternoon. The Bills' captain and five-time All-Pro guard, Billy Shaw, fights off rugged Houston and Twine on this play, but the Patriots' stacked defense contains Buffalo most of the day. Both Bobby Burnett and Jack Kemp have to leave the game with injuries, and the penalty stall Bill attack can only produce three points. But the play that jolts the Bills early is a 65-yard blast by Jim Nance. Tom Day explains how Boston's all-pro fullback beats the defense. Our job is to penetrate the hole and close it up to stop him from uh, getting through any hole at all. And actually, we stopped his momentum, but he bounced to the outside, and we couldn't hold on to him. And Harry Jacobs came across and grabbed him, and he couldn't hold on to him. And when he got into the secondary, I think the amazing thing about him is, is, was his speed. I don't think our backs realized how fast that uh, Nance could really run. This was a crucial score, but the league's player of the year didn't have an easy time the rest of the day. Other than that, run, I think we did a pretty good job on him. We held him to about 44 yards in so many carries, and he carried the ball quite a bit. The Battle of Boston is lost 14 to 3. But the Bills gain an opportunity to win the war when Joe Namath's Jets upset the Patriots the following Saturday. 